Meghalaya Chief Minister Conrad K. Sangma has announced that Chief Minister's Research Fellowship Funds, which currently funds research in the field of arts and culture, will be expanded to accommodate science and technology research as well. The Chief Minister made the announcement during his visit to Shillong Government College of Engineering on Monday, the first government engineering college in the state that received the approval of All India Council for Technical Education, AICTE, for starting engineering courses last month. He made the assurance when faculties of Shillong Polytechnic College appealed to the Chief Minister for funding of research in the field of science and technology. We are here in the Shillong uh, uh, Engineering College uh, premises and uh, we have come to see the overall uh, uh, infrastructures set up and uh, as you all know that the All India Council for uh, technical Education has uh, approved uh, the college uh, uh, and at least for uh, uh, certain courses that we can start now. And uh, with this approval from the AICTE, we'll be able to start the academic year from this year itself. So sometime around uh, August, uh, post-August 15th, uh, the classes will start. And therefore, I have just come to see whether the arrangements are uh, sufficient and whether anything needs to be done to ensure that the classes can start smoothly. And that is my purpose of my visit. And I'm very happy uh, that the department has worked very hard, number one, to get this approval. And uh, number two, uh, they have also made necessary arrangements so that classes will be able to start. Uh, this is a very important uh, phase and a step for us from the education point of view. And we've been waiting for this very long. And I'm very happy that finally the Shillong Engineering College uh, will start and classes will resume from this academic year. Yeah, and make sure that we are able to make uh, you know, this college a real good, good one and uh, you know, be able to provide good education to our children, our youngsters, our youth of the state. This is really a big thing for us and I hope that this will be a beginning of many, many more good things to come out here. I was discussing with the principal and with our director and secretary also while walking from the college uh, building to this polytechnic building that uh, in the future also we should have more courses out here but I would want to see that we start giving innovative courses, courses that will have kind of a hybrid in, because in today's world uh, you, you cannot look at one subject as just engineering, you know, everything is, is linked up today, you know, law is linked up with environment, environment is linked up with the Chief Minister inspected the building of the Engineering College and held consultations with the faculties of the college to understand requirements of the college. He assured that all concerns will be addressed to upscale the infrastructure for making the Shillong Government College of Engineering operational as mandated by AICTE. The college is located at Maulai Kanton Masar in the East Khasi Hills district and is affiliated with Northeastern Hill University. It will start with two undergraduate programs, civil engineering and electrical engineering, with an initial intake of 30 students each for the 2025-26 academic year. Batlung travelled far, quite far from the city. He's always left wondering if he's going to get done early to catch the bus back home to his village. Are you tired of waiting? Have you had enough of all the running around? Do you feel like giving up and just going home? Don't worry, you have the right to timely and efficient services. According to the Meghalaya Right to Public Services Act 2020, you have the right to obtain notified citizen-related services in Meghalaya within a given time limit from various government offices, including the DC offices, be it registration of deeds, application for tribal certificates or permission for events, you can access details of all notified services here. Many public services are now available under the Meghalaya Right to Public Services Act. You can apply for these services and check your application status on the MSPSDC web portal. If you're unsure how to apply online, seek assistance from someone in your village or visit a nearby common service centre. If a service you requested has been unfairly denied or delayed, you can appeal to higher authorities or the Commission to help you get the service. Visit the Meghalaya State Public Services Delivery Commission's website now at www. 
www.msbsdc.meghalaya.gov.in or you can also visit their office in the Horseshoe Building, Lower Lashmiya or send an email for assistance to cc.msbsdc at gmail.com 